was the key athlete of the week. Well, the Hazel Green Gymnasium is no stranger to state championship banners. You can see right here the girls basketball state championship banners with their six straight titles. Now, Kelsey Andrews, she's not just a girls basketball state champion. She's also a gold medalist and with bling like that, it's no wonder why she's our Hailey Mazda Key Athlete of the Week. On behalf of Hailey Mazda of Huntsville, we'd like to congratulate Kelsey Andrews as our Key Athlete of the Week. Thank you Congratulations. So much. Andrews was a member of the USA under 16 national team competing in the FIBA U16 Women's Americas Championship in June, where she was draped with a gold medal for winning the tournament. It was an honor because not many people get to do this, so it was very fun. And like Andrew said, not many have that opportunity. In fact, she was one of 12 girls on that team. Many had never played together before. It was very different than any other basketball uh, organization because playing with girls I didn't know it was it took a lot to get used to but again with the basketball IQ that I have it was easy like adapting. Basketball is in her DNA. In fact, her mother, Jamila John Andrews, was a two-time NCAA tournament attendee for the women's basketball team at LSU, not to mention her father, Carlos Andrews, played football under Mike DuBose at Alabama from 02 to 04. So sports is a part of who she is. But who does she look up to? My mom, my dad, and my sisters. My little sister inspired me the most simply because she's, she's um, the person who look up to me the most and my older sister with her basketball career. And after winning on the national stage, Andrews is excited to hopefully bring a seventh straight title to the Trojans. Being with this program is an honor. Like, it's amazing. Coach Tim, the girls, everything. It's just an honor to be here. Like, I love it already. And a huge congrats to Kelsey. Now, we're always looking for suggestions on who you think our key athlete of the week should be. So send in nominations year-round. They just have to be a high school-age student athlete. You can send them to myself, Claudia Chikamian, or the email on your screen, sports at whnt.com.